Whoa, what? What's going on here? She playing video games? She playing E.T.? That looks like E.T. Why is this happening right now? I didn't sneak into anybody's room? Did I? I didn't even mean to. I must have blacked out or something. I just like was in her room. That was weird. <laughs> That's scary. Okay, uh, sh oh, sure. Journey of the Prairie King for hours and I can't even beat the first level. The game is ridiculously hard. Or either that or I'm just terrible at it. Do you want to beat the level for you? Is that what you're going to say? I think I might do better with your help. Yeah, I'll beat this level. Watch this. What is this? Wow, this is... I wish this was part of the actual game. This is a fun game that's built into the game. Two player mode. Get the coins. What are we fighting here? Are these supposed to be orcs? <laughs> Come on, you couldn't beat this by yourself. You really needed my help. This, is, this hasn't been all that difficult yet. Halfway done. Okay. Can I buy something with a co- Oh, extra life! I'm gonna perfect this. I'm not even gonna get touched. Hey, that was fun. Yeah, sure it was. Well, thanks, Greg. You seem to really know your way around a joystick, huh? Oh, boy. We're just buying this shit. It's gonna be, what, a 3,000? I don't even care. Is there a way I can make this go faster? <laughs> there has to be a way I can do this faster, right? Oh well. It's worth dropping like a, a couple thousand. I got plenty of money. I don't even want to chop trees down. Who gears? Here, fast I'm clicking this? Oh, Linus, hey. I want to give you something. I want to- we gotta be friends. Please don't destroy my tent. Why do you always think I'm gonna do that? Look, here, I brought you some... I brought you some sashimi. We can share it. This is a great gift. You're very welcome. Is this a magician? What the hell? Oh my- <laughs> These dudes like shooting beams! Since when are they like shamans in this game? I'm getting my ass kicked. I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry! There was no hide in that one. <laughs> giant teddy bear? What? Okay, I got a giant bear and a singing stone. I need to see what this does. Oh, another annoying thing to annoy townspeople with. Can I kill this guy? Do I have to break his shell? Whoa! What is he dropping? I do not understand. God, maybe I can't kill him. <laughs> I'm just like trying to break his shell. Come on, what's on the inside? What kind of creamy goodness is in there? I can't wait to take that psychedelic mushroom and have a conversation with Elvis. Uh-oh. Hello there, Greg. So your first year in Stardew Valley is almost over, huh? If you keep buying seeds from me, you'll be twice as productive next year. And I have some exciting news. I'll be selling new seed varieties in my shop next year. Should have one new variety per season. Well, that's all I wanted to have to say. You have a good one. Oh, by the way. <laughs> you really did want to say, you know, I wouldn't even bother trying to my, get it my competitor. They're the highest quality seeds you can find anywhere. That's a promise, motherfucker. You understand? It's hard to do, Bill Clinton. He really kind of just talks with a sort of southern twang, but not really. Yeah. Hard to do, Bill Clinton. 
What does this guy want me to show him? I can show you something. You want to see something? I'll put a show on for you right now, buddy. What do you think about that? <laughs> Am I an actual fan of wrestling? Not anymore, but like 15 to 20 years ago, I loved wrestling. It was my life. When I was like 15 or 16 years old, I absolutely adored that sport. Just the theater and and like the drama. It was like it was like a soap opera. It was just fantastic. And all like the weird storylines and characters that they had. The WWF Attitude Era was it was just incredible. See, and you know now, this is what I feel like now about wrestling. They stepped away in recent years, like the last ten years probably I'd say, from the interesting quirky characters. The last time I watched wrestling, it was like guy with a first and last name in underwear versus another guy with a first and last name in underwear. Oh, here comes like Steve Johnson, and he's going to be taking on like Arthur Robertson. Both of them are wearing underwear. That's it. Uh, don't for don't forget for the main event, we have another guy, but this this time he's in green underwear. You think that's exciting? This next guy's in gray underwear. Oh, we've banned all the cool shit, by the way. God, Paul Barry was one of my favorite people ever. And the Undertaker! Kane! He's your brother, Kane! Oh, yes! Oh! The Undertaker! He will destroy you! And you have nowhere to hide! Oh, yes, Kane. Oh, of course. Vince McMahon was such a great villain. He was a supervillain. He he essentially was Norman Osborn. Right? Super rich guy with, like, all this power. If he put on a green suit and a mask, he could have been the Green Goblin. He was just Norman Osborn. It was great. Who's the, who's the guy that used to eat the turnbuckle? George the Animal Steel. Right? He used to, he used to eat the turnbuckle. He'd come into the stage, he was like a fat guy in a onesie, and he would come and he would just start biting the turnbuckle and he would rip it up and eat it. And that was, 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 that was a special move. He would then take somebody's head and smash it into like the steel that was underneath the soft turnbuckle which he had eaten. They don't do that anymore. Does a guy eat the turnbuckle anymore? No. <laughs> I'm the trash man. I come in there and I start eating garbage. <laughs> Danny DeVito. The trash man. Oh, gee, shit. Did I get you, Cricket? Must have been an edge on that can. There's a person's face. On that moon. Let's put the fishing hat on. <laughs> okay, now I'm just Donald Duck. <laughs> Donald Dump? <laughs> Donald Dump. Yeah, I got my new character, Donald Dump. <laughs> That's so stupid. Donald Dump. <laughs> That's such a perfect description. It's just Donald Duck, but Dump at the end. <laughs> uh, I love funny things. A crunchy cookie that's been soaking in milk is gross, but it's it's like a good slimy gross feeling. You kind of bite into the cookie and it like it just disappears, it like just melts into your mouth. And it's just, it's like 42% gross. But the other 68%, uh, I, I don't know if that's the correct math. 68, you know, the, uh, the other 58%, whatever this, it's, it's somewhere around 60, I don't know, I'm not a fucking mathematician. Sometimes, what ends up happening when you have a crunchy cookie of milk, you'll hang it in there, and, whoop, what's that? Cookie's gone. You lift it up a little bit, breaks off, goes to the bottom, and then you get the sludge cookie that stays at the bottom of your milk forever. And then at the end, you're kind of timid. You don't want to drink the rest of the milk because you know that the snot rocket that's at the bottom is going to go down your throat and it's going to make you gag. 
So, you know, it's, it's a give and take world when you eat crunchy cookies. I've got a special red mushroom vial. Hey, so you saw the notice? Oh, cool. Here's a little something for your trouble. Thanks. Still have to catch a squid. I've given this guy a lot of stuff. I wonder if he likes me yet. I would break down what just happened and be angry about it. But, I mean, there's nothing to say. This is a live one? I, okay. Fuck off. I don't even care. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Now we're all screwed. If you go to bed at 4 a.m., it's like your whole world's out of whack. You go to bed at 3 a.m., you're still okay. 4 a.m. is you're getting close to the sun being up. 4 to 5? Hey, alright. Staying up all night. You heard it here. We're, go we're going into Sunday, guys. That's how late we're going to be streaming this game. You wanted a long stream? You wanted like a fucking Sunday morning stream? You got it. Fuck, why did I just say that? Okay, here we go. Oh, it can do it, it can do it, it can do it, it can do it. Here we go. What's in it? Oh! Six... Where, did it, where is it? Six Iridium Ore. Two Geodudes. That's finally out of my fucking lawn. Oh, it's so happy to see that gone. Get rid of this. I don't want this shit anymore. I'd rather shit in my pants than look at this again. I'd rather wear a diaper and shit in the diaper and not change the diaper for three days than look at this fence. It's gone. It kind of feels empty, doesn't it? Yeah, I miss it. I miss it, it was right here. It's been here since the first 10 minutes of this game. I, I don't like it. I need something there. <laughs> you killed my brother. <laughs> yeah, I can make a meteor monument. Yeah, I'll do that, here. Don't worry, watch, watch, watch. I already have the perfect idea. Yeah, see? Okay. See, this is singing the song of the old meteor. How funny it would be if another one just landed right on top of me right now. I don't know what is what and what's where and where's why and why's who and who's what. You know? Like, fuck. The moon, the bear, and the big blue house. Waiting. To come and play. 24 adjacent tiles. That's insane. God, that's... Getting, is it hot in here? I mean... I'm getting a little flustered at that sprinkler. Uh, Aquamuin. Fairy Stone. Jamba White. Um, refined Quartz. <laughs> that one didn't... That one is how you say it. Refined Quartz. <laughs> Quab pot, Howardwood, Ionua, Quay, uh, Ka, Kapabawa. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I promise I'm done. Star food. <laughs> I'm stuck. Get me. Somebody reboot me. <laughs> Somebody put your finger on my button. Press the button to, to reset me. <laughs> we gotta weeboot me. Just hold the button down and give it a quick weeboot. Weeboot me. 
Uh, it's getting late. I'm starting to lose my fucking brain. <laughs> I, thought, I thought I was seeing things. <laughs> I need a walleye. <laughs> I thought that was supposed to... Ah, oh, I love it. Holy goodness! El Diablo, El Dio de Diablo de Odil de los Muertos. I, no, I said El Dio de Diablo de Odil de los Muertos. El Dio de Diablo de Odil de los Muertos. <coughs> I'll, I'll go real slow. El Dio de Diablo de Odil de los Muertos. El Dio de Diablo de Odil de los Muertos. I got all day. We're getting a red lava fish. Got one! Woo! No! No! Ah, fucking deal, lady. I'm letting you let us win. Fuck. Delete the save and start over. Fucking let us win. Fuck. Deal, let us win. Fuck. <laughs> How can there be this much trash in this lava pit? Who's been down here? To throw just absolute garbage into this little lake. We're talking about being down 100 meters into the Earth's crust. And there's broken glasses in here. That's bullshit. The only thing that's in here are fucking monkfish. And I want to catch one. Like, whose shitty mixtape is down here? <laughs> what a shitty house. Okay, so uh, welcome to the tour of the house. These are the windows. These are the only windows in the whole house. They're all right next to each other, and there's no window in any other room. Ah, the <laughs> French. Do you, do you see how many refined quartz I have? I got 14. I have a million. He has an iridium bidet that washes 24 adjacent buttholes. <laughs> I have to... <laughs> Alright, here's some, here's some insight, guys. You ready? I'd say like 50% of the time I, I go to the bathroom in my toilet. I sit down with my pants on first. And sit there for like a full two minutes. So the seat is warmer. <laughs> like if I have a pair of jeans on, I'm just sitting on the toilet with a pair of jeans on. Until it gets to a point where I can sit on it and it's like, Oh, this is nice and nice. This is fine. This is room temperature now. That's not how you poop your pants. It's not... <laughs> okay. You guys act like I sit down with the jeans on, and what, I forget they're there? Oh, I, I'm tired, I'm tired to sit on, I guess the shit's gonna come out now. Oh, the shrooms. They've always been celebrated for their excellence. There is a California shroom by Paul Marceau. Inspired by that same shroom X. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fucking die right here. Oh my god, I'm gonna die! I'm dead. I'm fine. <gasps> what? What the fuck? Oh! It's like, it's like it never happened. So we, we actually did not talk about anything that we talked about. Including or pretending to potentially sitting down on a toilet and warming it before you use it.